Hello everyone and welcome to the class. In this short little video tutorial, my, uh, by the way, this is David A. Cox along with my co-host, Ben Pegg. And today we are going to show you how to auto-tune your voice in the latest version of GarageBand. That would be uh, GarageBand version 10 for the Mac. Today's date, I always like to mention just to keep things relevant, today's date is uh, December 30th of 2014. So if you're watching this significantly into the future, it is always possible that things may have changed. So uh, auto-tune is that effect that you may have heard in a lot of the pop music that's out there, whether you're listening to Chris Brown or Rihanna or even Cher. Uh, with, of course, that, you know, Do You Believe in Life After Love? I think that was the first major song uh, that that used auto-tune, also known as pitch correction, uh, where you can be completely off-key and make it sound like you are. It sounds very electronic in the process, so it doesn't sound natural, uh, depending on how far you take it. Um, but and it's, I find it kind of ironic that we have Ben Pegg here, who is like, one of my favorite musicians and it's like oh by the way ben we need you to sing awful today this well, is a no way a total waste of your time i think i have an idea if we wanted someone to sound awful we should have me singing but then again <laughs> we're trying to get decent ratings on this video so we'll we'll spare your ears and cause them not to bleed so uh do you have any idea what you're going to be singing i think i would be well out of my depth singing what what you just said was the original auto-tune song so i'm gonna i think i'm gonna attempt the uh um, life after love. Fantastic. I'm sure our listeners will just love that. They'll eat that up and I'm in no way being sarcastic. So we have created just a brand new audio track here. We're just going to record it and then I'm going to show you afterwards how to autocorrect it. So here we go. Let's just record. Ready? Do you believe in life after love? Well, that's all I need. Ben, here's your Grammy. Now get out. Um, so let's rewind <laughs> no. here. I'm just giving you a hard time. <laughs> so let's rewind here. And here's how you do the actual uh, auto-tune process. If you go here to the top left corner of your screen, you have these little scissors icon, which if you hover over it, it says editors. We're going to click on that. And it uh, makes this extra little bar show up at the very bottom. And if you look here, we have pitch correction, uh, which we can turn on. Okay, by default, by the way, this is set to off, so uh, I don't actually know if it just recorded it. Did no, it, it won't record. It okay. didn't record yeah, it with yeah. it? Okay. All right, so you can just put that up to 100%, and if you know the key of the song that you're singing in, you can hit limit to key, otherwise you can just leave it turned off. Is that correct? Yes. Okay. So uh, now that we've recorded it and we've put the pitch correction up to 100%, let's see how incredible, awesome... Ben Pegg now sounds. Ben Pegg as Cher. Do you believe in life after love? Now, Ben isn't wearing <laughs> headphones. I'm not. So I actually have no idea oh, how yeah. that sounded. I'll find out in the editing process. <laughs> it's so, ready. So they're ready for the club. So there you go, folks. That is how you auto tune here in GarageBand. Obviously, if you want a more electronic sound, you want the pitch correction to be turned up to, you know, upwards of 100%. If you just need a little bit of help here and there, you can turn it down to maybe 40% uh, or really just do it as necessary. This is David A. Cox along with my co-host. Ben Pegg. And we have wasted your time, Ben, but thank you for being here. <laughs> uh, please check out the other tutorial videos that we're creating on GarageBand. We want to do short videos instead of one giant long one since this is very complex software. So hopefully, if you would like, you're welcome to check those out as well. That's all for us today. Today, everyone, take care.